All right, next up, we got Catelyn, blonde fighter, Chikagian. She faces off against uh, Vivian Vivi Araujo. Chikagian is coming off a decision win over Cynthia Calvillo, while Araujo is coming off a decision win over Roxanne Mataferi. What you think, man? Um, I don't know. This is a tough one because Caitlin Chik- or Catelyn Chik- Chikagian... My bad. Catelyn Chikagian, okay. she was... a hard name. She's, she's, <laughs> <laughs> she, I mean, like, her past couple fights have been a little spotty, you know? Like, yeah, for she, sure. She lost the title fight against Shevchenko and yeah, the but everybody sister. loses that. Yeah. yeah, that's true. I mean, she she looked real crisp on the on the feet. I'm talking about Shevchenko. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> and then um, and uh, Vivian Arajo. I mean, she she's real fast. Like she's very mm-hmm. agile. So I think I think that would give her and cause some problems. Even though um, Ka- Catelyn keys that reach advantage. Mm-hmm. You know, to keep her distance. Advantage. Yeah, but I don't know the way she gets in and out. It, it, it's just too quick, man. Yeah, like some like some fights, Chikagian looks like really good in maintaining that that distance. You know, against in the Cavio fight, she did it really well. But in other fights, you know, especially the Andrade fight, yeah, like it just it looked like she couldn't keep her away. And um, you know, Roger comes with that pressure similar to Andrade, and I, I and you know she does a good job of entering, you know, kind of mm-hmm. like moving her head. And then when when she does throw, you know, she throws in combos, and I, I, um. Yeah, like so, Trigagian for sure will need to be on point. Use her. Uh, well, I think they have the same reach. I was about to say, I think she has a reach in her, but I believe they have the same reach. So uh, I think she'll only have the height advantage. Let me see here. I think. I think they're. Yeah, they actually do. Chikagian. Yeah, yeah, right. They both, okay, so she won't have the reach advantage, but I mean, it's different being tall, you know. Yeah. So she'll have that. Her. She. I'm pretty sure her legs are longer. She and she likes to use them front kicks, deep kicks to kind of keep her opponents at bay. She's really gonna need to use that to kind of um, take that pressure off because I know I know Vivienne's gonna be coming all night, man. Like coming yeah. forward, it, it, her stamina is pretty crazy too. I mean, if she kept that pace. I think I want to say it was in the Montana De La Rosa fight, and then even in the third round, she like switched up her her style a little bit. I don't know if you remember that, but I kind of don't. Um, <laughs> but like in the third round, like uh, she's she just like switched it up. It was it was kind of weird, but but she I mean she worked well with it. But I think the different look um, might not happen in this fight just because I mean I don't think she'll need to do that. Mm-hmm. But um, yeah I mean yeah, well I mean I think I think Chukagan will have a really hard time keeping um, Araujo off of her, and I think she's gonna come in get her shots and then get out. And then we're just going to see a constant repetition of that. Because I, I don't think either girl can really finish each other. Ch- mm-hmm. I mean, a big uh, wild card, I think, is if maybe Chukagan takes it to the ground. That's Yeah, that's what I was thinking. But too. I don't know, man. I, 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 I feel like I don't, I won't, uh, I honestly don't know. Yeah, because I, I feel I, like that's the biggest kind of if factor. Yeah, because I, I don't know. I mean, I'm, I don't, I'm not sure Catlin could um, keep up with her on the feet, in my opinion. I think I think if they stay in the feet, and she's probably gonna lose by decision. But if she manages to get a couple of takedowns in there, I think she can win over the fight. Who? Uh, Chikagian, yeah. So you have Chikagian? No, oh, I, have, okay. I, have, I have I have a, I have a Rajo. Oh, like, that's just what you're saying. Yeah, because I, I was like, I think the only way she really wins is if she goes for the takedown. Oh, because if if she stays in the feet, I think she's gonna get you know pieced up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, I agree. I agree. I I, I feel like she. Um, it, I feel like she won't be able to get the takedown, and oh, yeah. and Araujo will just keep constantly coming in, and I think Araujo will win it by decision. Mm, yeah, Araujo has she has like a great takedown defense actually. Oh, she does. I think so. Yeah, I forgot who it was against. I want to say no, I don't remember, but it's probably against Montana De La Rosa. I think she's a wrestler. Probably. Yeah, probably. I don't remember, but I mean, I mean, she lost to Jessica I, though. Mm-hmm. But I mean, just a guy came in like five pounds over okay overweight. Right. So I mean, I'm pretty sure Chukagian lost to just guy too. She did. I think so. Oh, yeah, she did. She did. All right, we have confirmation that she <laughs> did. She indeed. <laughs> they both lost to just guy. Was it by decision as well or no? Okay, Dang. so she was a little closer. <laughs> yeah. But, I mean, but, just guy, I guess, is a veteran though. She knows how to win fights. That's true. I mean, she still looked good in that fight. But yeah, I think I think Vivian. Araujo wins by decision as well. Same. Okay. Yeah, I agree with you. All right. I guess we'll look forward to that one, see if Chikagian ends up using her wrestling or if she 
stands up and strikes, and we'll see who wins that.